You probably haven't heard that when it comes to a Speed Queen, just like every other washer on the market, it actually has a computer board behind the head. Now, it's impossible to get a computer that's consumer grade without this computer. Speed Queen does have one rare bird model, a TV2000. You're not gonna find it in most stores, but it is available. It only comes with a three year parts warranty. It is truly a commercial unit. It doesn't have to abide by the normal eco nonsense that our government is passing. And look, I'm all about saving energy and water. I get it. I don't want to be a bad steward of the resources we have. But when you talk to consumers, they want a washer that fills all the way up, but they also want a washer that's large capacity. They want to do their king size comforter in their own home, in their own water. They don't want to have to go to some laundromat where some stranger has left all their filth in the bottom of the washer and now they get to wash in it and waller in it. Old washers have old water. Laundromats have dirty water left in it. Most people don't tell you about the Speed Queens that they do have computers. There's a computer in two different areas. Almost every Speed Queen has two computers inside of it and it's part of how it operates if our government would just leave washers and dryers alone we could have some good machines i believe the free market would allow other brands to make better things instead what everybody's focusing on is super huge capacity and bright colors now speed queen's catching up as you know they're in the middle of making a factory to increase the size of this also, now they're introducing their matte black that's coming out in the TR series. So that's kind of exciting. It's good that they're listening to the people. Speed Queen is pretty good about that. They want to give what the people want, but they also do want to provide a unit that can last for 25 years. So your Speed Queen, if you go get one today, it will have electronic components, and that's okay. And if you didn't do all your laundry in one shot, if you did little loads throughout the week, then you would be okay with the capacity. It really is the king size comforter issue. That's kind of the biggest thing. And they're working on it. So I'm glad that Speed Queen's actually working on it. I'm glad they're trying to fix it. In the meantime, you still have to put up with a government regulated machine with a computer. It is what it is.